beautiful friends, how are you? This is Viviana. Uh, I know you see a mess in here. Uh, so I am making the, uh, I'm making another flip tag. And guess what? When I was in the middle of cutting the cardstock, voila. I remember that I offered you a tutorial. So I just got one collection, but you can do, you can mix them. And I start cutting the some works that the collection has some borders that I will be using them. And I start cutting the tags that I'm going to be using. So the other day I was learning that you do this part, okay? You can cut them in different sizes. As you can see, I have one longer than the other. This is more uh, wide than this one. This is gonna give the look. And then I have, I have this one, and but I'm gonna make it double-sided. Even though this is a cardstock, I don't wanna put anything plain in the back. I don't like it. There's another thing that I don't like, however, I respect the people who does that. I like to embellish my tags both sides. I know that some people said that's a lot of work. Well, but that this is what it's about. Because you do this and then nothing is gonna be displayed in the back. I don't, I'm not happy about it. Um, just give me a second. Sorry, I had a phone call. So um, I want to, I want this part to look the same. So let me show you what I did. So you get the first, the first uh, side. And you're gonna, uh, well, okay, I'm gonna do it with a different one that I'm not gonna be using now. Uh, I'm gonna do this. So I'm gonna cut this uh, this corner just uh, because I have to. And then this one goes in here, you see? Now you just tip it over and put it in this one. And then when you cut, it's going to be exactly the same. You see? So now that I have my first uh, my first one cut, it, uh, then I do this, the second one. And you see it's same. It measures the same. Even though it could be wider or, or um, long, it doesn't matter from here to here. I did the same. And this is what I am going to do. I just want that part to be even. So I'm going to do it this way and then I hold it and I'm going to do it this way. You can embellish, um, eh, I'm sorry, you can cover the back of the tag. Let me see in here. I know this is going to be a little bit more tricky. You can do that um, the way I am doing it or if you want to do it different, what I'm going to do is I'm going to play. I'm going to play a little bit with this one so not too not to the left not to the since this since this one since this one it's it's wider what I'm going to do it what I did was I played to put to put it in the center I don't know if my if you understand what I'm trying to say. Now I'm going to take this one. You see this one, it's it's longer and I want to use it. And then I am going to put it in here. I know that I know that this one, it's wide. I mean, this one, it's wider. So I'm going to tip this one over right here. And I'm going to play with it. I, I don't want it. You see, I'm not going to cut it in here because this side it's wider. So I'm gonna scooch this one a little bit that I have kind of the same um, the same amount in space and in this one also. I know that uh, I get stuck in my English, but it doesn't matter. The most important thing is that you got what I'm gonna say. So in here, So 
Can you see? And now I'm going to put it in here. You can mix them uh, like a big one and then a small one and then a medium one and then the other one. That's part of the game. And I'm going to do exactly the same. I don't want to use... I'm going to use this one, which is uh, small. So this is what I do. You see? Look at it. I am going to align this one to here. Why I want to do it this way? Because remember that I'm going to place in there the, the ring. Let me push a little bit more. I hope, I hope you guys... Uh, understand the mess that I am trying to explain here but okay I have the same um, I have this uh, just one collection but as I just told you you can mix the collections that that's up to you uh, I made one for a friend and I picked a little bit of everything and I like the way it turned and I like the way it turned uh, but I can't show you. I wanted to show you, but she's going to be watching the video. And then, no way. Uh, so this is what I am going to be making for now. This is the the, the way that you uh, put all together. Because it measures the same in the top. So you can make the hole that everything is in the same, uh, in the same um, place, even. And... I am going to do this one as well, but uh, because look, what I want to do, it's like this one. I want to, I want to put it in here and do a double sided. You see, but I am, I am planning here that I am talking to you, get a different collection of paper. I think I'm gonna, I'm gonna get a different collection that match. To put it in the back because I don't want I don't want to bore you know to to I don't want that the person receive like see it's the same kind of flowers so I'm gonna look something that that I can match and and then I'll be back okay uh, at least you know the process of the process of cutting these parts so they will they will they will measure at least it's not, it doesn't have to be perfect. It's just if you are the kind of person like me that I want to have the, that I would like, that the whole will be in the same, uh, pretty much in the same. So for now, this is the way I'm going to do it, okay? I am going to try to see if I can come back with the other part, okay? Give me just one second. Okay, since I didn't uh, want to, uh, to have the same pattern in here, in the back, I took um, six by six cardstock from another collection that match, and this is what I did. So this is what I'm doing now. I can do it with my trimmer, but sometimes you um, can be a little bit faster. And this is what I did. So I have another one, and this is the back. Now I'm going to take, I have another piece for the other uh, uh, group of tags that I'm going to be making. And because you know that we don't throw anything away. So I am going to do this one. I love, love, love this combination, this match of colors. So I am going to place the glue in this tag. There's people that uh, put that use paper and they use in between cereal boxes or um, crackers or whatever kind of boxes they have, which is okay. And then I am going to stick it in here in the corner. But anyway, you need to put it um, double because for more hard that is the cardstock when you embellish it's gonna be weak if you don't put it double i wish i can show you the one that i made because 
you can see the whole details but as i just told you that lady is going to be um checking the the video she's active in the page <laughs> i am no go sherry i am talking about you and she knows that uh it's for her but she doesn't know what it's about she doesn't know anything there you go so i have another one now i'm going to play with my third one uh, this is to put it in there so i use this one i use this one i use this one i want to use this one and i am going to invent with i think i'm going to use this one So my day, I am, I'm happy, I am not tired, I, I wouldn't say tired, I just want to, I have, I, I just want to make this, uh, because I like to be doing something, even though, let me tell you girls, this trains a little bit, depends on the on the pages on the tags that you're going to be uh, making because you shouldn't repeat the not necessarily the pattern but the embellishment um fact i know maybe you're asking why well, you didn't use your trim well look i did it much faster I make yesterday 20 clusters, 40 um, envelopes, uh, and I think it was like 12, yeah, a dozen of, of uh, mini file, uh, mini file folders. Now I am going to, why not? Let me check in here this one do i have this one yes yes uh, but not this one which is a small however i'm not going to use that one because i don't want to repeat it so what i am going to do is using this pattern i am going to cut in here And then I am going to stick it in here. Let me tell you, this is a, a very, very interesting and and fun um, hobby or um, project. That's the word, project, because your mind is working constantly and. Uh, you let your imagination flies. Let me see that everything is okay. Yeah, that's fine in here. And now I have to go to the Dollar Tree to buy a, a ring because my situation is that I, when I embellish, I like bulky. And then, so I have one, two, three, four, five. And I am going to find something that I <clears throat> yeah I just trying to avoid repeat this as same you know like the same tag let me see in here 
I am going to And you really fits just right in the edge. So now sorry for my sometimes I don't talk too much if I am working. And I don't do this live because it's hard for me to work with the camera while I am making something like this. And then I won't be able to stop just in case I have to stand up because believe it or not, while I am doing this, I have uh, stand up like three times, but I put, the, I put it in pause because my mom needed me. And so this is this is gonna be what I want. So I will be adding more because I like 10 to become 20. So but I'm gonna just uh, for the video I'm gonna do this one. So um, let me see which one I want in the back. Oh my gosh, I love them all. So I'm gonna do this one in the front. Oh yeah. And then this one next, and then, no, and then, uh, let me see, oh, this one next, and then this one, and then this, and then this, and the last one, this one. I'm going to show you how to make the holes. I'll be back. So I got my cropper dial, and I'm gonna be using the three um, sixteenths in here because um, I don't want it too small. And I just, you know, I eyeball. Um. Let me see if I am not that bad. Oh my God. I'm gonna do something better. I usually do everything eyeball, but since I am um, showing you, let me see in here, if this one measures one and, one and three, let me see, it could be like, there you go. I'm trying to be more uh, specific with you, but I don't do it that way. I never take measures of anything. Can you see? And I have to go and get a, 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 a big ring because if I make it out of 10, this is too small for me because I am going to put it chunky. That's why I need a bigger one. So since all my things measures the same, oopsie. I am going to do this, but as, again, don't don't bother your existence because I don't do that. I'm just doing it because it's you. But if not, and now, I 
because that's a good thing that it looks messy that's what I like it looks messy So this is what I became with. Um, so I decided to glue it um, both sides, as I just told you. Sorry for the mess, but I am working. And did you see this is what I'm saying? I made one, two, three, uh, four, five, six times two. It's twelve. But this is uh, this is going to be um, um, chunky because if I make it. If I will do my art 3D, but without being exaggerated like I am, uh, it will be okay. But remember that once I start putting things plus the plus the ribbons and the tool, whatever, there's a mistake that I make when I did the first one. I have to disassemble the whole thing and uh, put it back again. It's not with the with the art by itself. It was with this. I will suggest to you that when you fix everything, this part, you are going, to, um, I will suggest you to tie everything in this part because if you have to do this, it will be easier to open. But if for any reason this one goes right here, then once it gets chunky, then it's a mess to see it. So, and when I said to see it, it's to play with it. So I will suggest you that you pay attention and when you start tying the bows and everything that you find and, and ribbons and whatever, the trims, you start doing it from here. That's what I would do because I make that mistake, oh my God. So, and let me show you what I have so far. And, and listen, it's very, very, very hard. So I have this one. Then I have this one. Then I have this one. Then I glued two uh, flowers uh, a make out of a hole punch. I glued two together in cardstock. So I'm going to embellish that one too. And then I have this one. And then I have this one. And I'm going to be doing it both sides. Did you see what I'm saying? Look at Since I am holding this part was easier for me to move but if it, if that wasn't the case i will be like messing up this thing so this is what i have so far i am going to start working on this and once it's ready i am going to post a picture or i will do another video this is just uh for you to know how it's the the base by itself how you're going to to put everything together before you put your art okay so i hope you like it i hope you um enjoy um sorry if i get stuck in any of my language however um here i am and whatever question you have you will uh, feel free to ask me bye i love ya